And here's new video from Capitol Hill, where three weeks to the day since Kevin McCarthy was ousted, his nameplate that had been hanging above the speaker's office has now been removed. But whose name is going to be there? And when? Let's bring in NBC News Capitol Hill correspondent Ali Vitali. Ali, what's the latest? Is this vote going to go through three hours from now? Well, it's quiet here, maybe too quiet, but also it's the first time we've seen the Kevin McCarthy speaker sign come down, Mika. So that's a new thing that might lend a little bit more confidence to the vote that we expect to see sometime in the noon hour. It putting up Mike Johnson, a relatively low profile Louisiana congressman, up for the speaker's gavel. A lot of this happened in the late hours of last night after a full day of meetings. Republicans huddled behind closed doors for the larger part of yesterday. They had one nominee at the start of the day in Tom Emmer, as you pointed out. Quickly, that shifted in the evening to becoming Mike Johnson. And it happened as members were fatigued, they were frustrated. And I do really feel like those were key pieces of the puzzle that maybe hadn't reached enough of a fever pitch to actually get lawmakers to coalesce behind someone, in this case, the four-term congressman.